Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for all the Leos who are having birthday from the, um, yeah, from the 7th until the 14th. So, you Leos, okay, it is the 32 week of the month and I want to say thank you to each and every person. Thank you for your likes and shares and uh, your support. And I want to say to everyone who has reached out to me for a reading, thank you for using my channel and for contacting me for a reading. And I am hoping to do the best for you. Um, and I want to say to each and every person, go back and listen to um, the month reading in the middle of the month. And please remember to go back and listen to their year reading because there is a lot of information that is going to come out. I want to say to you, Leas, it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful time because we have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 until the 12. So it's going to be wonderful. And it's going to be good because you have the energy vibration in this week of the lovers. And this is one of your last zodiac energy vibration for the year 2017. So after this week, um, half of next week will be for some of the rest of the Leas um, who are having birthdays. So for you, Leas, you got the energy vibration for... Um, well, the year 2017 and it is the energy of the lovers so this is wonderful whatever is happening it is uh, wonderful it's a positive energy it is a good energy and you also have it double so what is it that you Leah should be knowing for this zodiac year of 2017 is that you are going to find a love of your life it is here twice um, you have this card whenever this card comes up in a reading and especially it comes up as a um, the weak energy vibration for you Leos uh, this is was the energy vibration of the year 2017 so for the Leos who were born between the 17 and the 12 of uh, um, July you are going to meet your soulmate and twin flame in this year 2017 and remember 2017 is past when your birthday has passed so the next day it will begin the year 2017 remember this people okay so this is wonderful and this is one of my favorite decks it's kind of a, a weird deck but i liked it and you have also the energy of the lovers the next energy that uh, we're going to ask uh, um is the energy of strength okay so you have the energy of strength whatever is happening um, you have the lovers and also the energy of strength so for a lot of people they will be ending relationships because they have found their true love whatever is happening they have formed their true love and they're ending their relationships and you're going to see wonderful new situations that are happening in your life and this is going to be extremely positive okay I had another card um, out but it's of a lower energy vibration okay let's get into it because um, it's going to be a, a good a good year okay as we are looking at uh, the people who were born on the 7th of August congratulations we have the energy of the chariot the energy of the chariot is a wonderful wonderful energy because it's victory and success movement a lot of movements some people will be moving location some people will be just moving to different um, situations in their life uh, a lot of people will be um, changing their relationship and that sort of a thing so it's going to be a positive positive year for you so for the people who were born on the seventh and this is the energy vibration of also the number seven you have the energy of the chariot this is a victory and a success for some people that is going to happen um, after your birthday this is uh, a year that is going to bring you a lot of positive endeavor with success we always have the haters so a lot of people will be um you know getting like situation with stab in the back but it's going to be a year where a lot of people are going to be um become aware it's, it's as if you 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 are becoming aware of certain things in your life so whatever is happening um for you people that if it's born under seven there is going to be a lot of uh, respect recognition happening for you guys a lot of respect and recognition happening for you guys so be aware of this okay this is going to be wonderful whatever is happening so your year 
for the people who were born on the seventh your hair is going to be a wonderful year it's going to be really a year of positive energy for the people who were born on the eight we have the energy vibration of the lovers and it's going to be good in business whatever is happening in your business it's going to be good so if you're starting a business in this year of 2070 which is after your birthday or you're already started because your zodiac birthday for 2007 really happened after your birthday this is going to be good so a lot of people are going to be meeting your twin flames and soulmate in this year but yet still you're going to be sharing and um, love but yet on a higher energy vibration level okay so you'll be meeting the love of your life some people will be in a relationship and there's going to be an end of your old relationship so you can start this new relationship the energy of the Pentacles uh, the um, page of Pentacles is going to be in your life so a lot of people are going to find good business um, business people that is going to come in and connect with you and it's going to be wonderful okay the other energies that we have here be aware be aware of what's where is happening for some people there is going to be situation at your work there is also be going to be a situation where um, people are going to try to steal your ideas or that sort of a thing people are going to try to profit from you whatever it is but be aware of whatever is happening and ask the universal angels for divine interventions for whatever that is going on ask source creator ask the creator of all things and the angels and guide to help you to protect your financial situation in this year and to help you to protect you from people who will be um um, you know uh, making money of your own creations because there's a lot of people who are stealing people ideas and that sort of a thing and as I've always said if something was not meant for you and something isn't in your blueprint no matter what you do to try and extract things from other people it's not going to work so a lot of people are going to try to profit from you so be aware of what is happening as we move on to the ninth the people who were born on the 9th of August we have a spiritual year coming up for you this year is going to be a very spiritual year whatever is happening there is a lot of, 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 of your enemies are going to come out of the woodwork this energy is your energy is the energy of people who have been against you is going to come out of the woodwork but what this is going to do um, for some people is that whatever that was happening whatever um, that was stolen from you will be returned okay whatever that was stolen from you will be returned so let's say that people have done you injustice and now in this year of 2007 which will um, happen after your birthday so it will happen on the 10th from the tent on you will see a different change coming in your life so this is going to be wonderful it's going to be a spiritual year and make use of the spiritual year because I love whenever the spiritual year comes up they comes up um, every seven years um, for you to try find your true note and it's going to help you in a in a significant way in this year because uh, um, it's going to awaken you to your intuition and your spirituality it's going to help you to connect to the angels and guides whatsoever here is happening your this the energy of the hermit is going to help you your spirit guides and universal angels are going to help you so whatsoever that is happening here that uh, um, you know your enemies and people trying to steal your ideas and that sort of a thing you're going to see a positive positive endeavor that is going to come out in your life okay um, it's it's um, whatever is is, is is happening trust me um, and whatever that was stolen will be returned to you okay all right we are looking at the people who were born on the 10th of August the people who were born on the 10th of August and we have the wheel of fortune congratulations congratulations whatever that has been blocking you whatever that has been holding you back for the last seven years congratulations the wheel of fortune is going to break it down whatever it was the wheel of fortune is going to break it down because when your life seems as if it's not moving or whatever is happening there are certain people certain energies that are trying to block you because a lot of times when people see you're doing good they don't wish you good and this is what I'm trying to explain to other people whenever you wish someone bad 
and you break someone energy's vibration it's going to happen to you and this is what happened is that the tower comes in and what the tower is doing the tower is shaking up a lot of stuff so whatever that has been happening in your life the tower is going to shake this up and it's going to move whatsoever is happening out of your life for good and uh, Finally, you are going to get a positive message coming in. This positive message can be for some people who have been going through a rough time in their relationship and that sort of a thing. And then they are going to get a message. This is about business too, a lot of business. If you were waiting on stuff that has to do with government authority, it's going to happen for you. Whatever that you were working on, it's going to come out and it's going to happen for you. So congratulations. This year of 2017 for you people who were born on the 10th of August and this is the number 10 the wheel of fortune it's going to be positive for your number in this year it's going to be 27 that's 9 and 10 it's going to be a wonderful positive year okay it's going to be a positive year so you who were born on the 10th congratulations it's going to be a wonderful year expect a lot of wonderful beautiful things coming in your life as we move on we have the energy vibration of judgment and this is a good judgment a good judgment okay so let's see if your life has been one of ups and down you know all over the place or if not um, good information is going to come into you in this year positive information wonderful positive information is going to come in and this information is going to stir you to a better part in your life this information is going to move you to some place which is much better whatever that has been happening to you um, is as if the universal angels came down and says uh, it's to hear and no further this person life is going to change to something positive this person is going to get whatever their blueprint had sent them this person is going to be a positive person which is the universal angels is coming in to help you so congratulations also the this energy of judgment is a positive energy the energy of judgment is good because it's bringing you a victorious and successful endeavor whatever it was it's bringing you a victorious and successful endeavor okay so this is also a newness of new prosperity is going to come in your life new information of you being victorious people are going to see you people are going to understand that you have gone through so much and now because of uh, the universal angels see what is happening you're going to see a positive situation coming out and yeah oh yeah we have the energy of the sun so this is success and the end of um our times in your life this is success if your life was always good it's going to be extremely better whatever you have been trying is striving for it's going to come up it's going to open up as if like never before so this is going to be extremely positive so whatever that has been going on in your life and around you you are going to see a really positive things success coming good luck your energy is going to you're going to feel on top of the world in this year right after your birthday you're going to start feeling the situation whatever that has happened you're going to be victorious over it and you're going to stand with your head up and with integrity okay as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the world for the people who were born on the 12 we um 7 8 12 congratulation okay the energy of the number 12 is always keep your thoughts positive but yet this is when you change it and reverse it you have the number 21 so whatsoever is happening three is going to be your number for this year because the positivity of this card and this year is that it's the end of situation and new beginnings whatever that has been happening it is the end of a situation and new beginning whatever the situation that has been going on in your life there is a message that is coming to you a lot of good messages are coming to you this is for people who um, 
each and every person that was born on the 12th, it's going to be positive. It's going to be an extreme, extreme positive year. These two messages together is good news, good news. So whatever the situation is in your life, it's going to be good news about love. It's coming in with this message. And this one is going to be good news about business. So whatsoever is happening in your life uh, and you're about to start a business, go ahead and do it because it's going to be positive. It's going to be such a positive, vibrant thing that you're going to see things uh, are going to change in your life uh, like it has never been before. This energy of the world is hemmed in situation that has been happening in your life and opening up new doors of opportunities in love and in business. So this is going to be extremely positive. So again, congratulations with your birthday. Happy birthday to all you people out there and understand that love is the only thing that is real. Wonderful messages for you people who were born on the 12th of August. As we move on to the energy of the 13th of August, we have the energy of uh, um, strength. Strength. You have to and you need to find inner strength in this year of um, 2017 because your birthday really begins uh, on the day after. Okay, the year 2017 zodiac energy vibration begin the year after. So what is going to happen is that with the energy of these positive energies that are coming out, you are going to feel such a wonderful positive energy because there is going to be a connection of a soul family. Okay, this is going to be a connection of a soul family. And with these people who are coming in your life, you have asked them to be in your life at this time. And through this year, you're going to have such a good positive connection with them and they're going to help you to move you to something more positive in your life. So this is going to be wonderful. So what is coming up with that? A surprise. So whatever is happening, especially for the women, this is going to be a year where the women are going to be um, having children. They're going to be having children. Um, a lot of you are going to be connecting with babies who you know from lifetime and lifetime before. A lot of special gifts for the women are coming in. So it's not a year so it says, oh my God, I got strength. Why couldn't I get something much better? A temperance. It is a year where you're going to bring balance to certain situation in your life. So you're going to connect with soul families. You're going to meet a lot of people who you're going to connect with. And they were sent in um, from the universe to you. And these are going to bring you wonderful, positive situation in your life. So again, the energy of temperance um, is good in this year because you're going to connect to a lot of soul family, a lot of soul people, and this is going to bring you positive, positive energies in your life in this year. So as I recap this um, week, this week uh, for you people who were born from the 7th until the 13th, it's going to be a really positive week because of the energy of love. And you also have the energy of love here and you have strength. So what you should understand is that whatever the situation is going on, whatever that is happening there, whatever you have been coping with in the year, because actually your birthday year is going to start after the date of your birthday and whatever that you were coping in with seven years before seven years before I'm seeing something with seven years before this is going to now come to an end okay because we you have the energy vibration that is pulling you and that is the energy of love so there's going to be a whole lot of twin flame and a whole lot of soulmate connection that is going to happen in this year for each and every person once your birthday is between the 7th and the 13th of August you're going to see these positive positive energies coming up and with these positive energies coming up you're going to have a true understanding of what is about to come because there is going to be positive positive um, situation that is going to come in your life positive energies that is going to come in your life and this is going to bring out wonderful situation in your life that is going to help you to move you in this year to some place better after you have uh, um, acknowledge that you need to make changes you need to make positive changes in your life 
again it doesn't really matter what is coming up because uh, for the people who have been you know going through certain stuff what is happening here is that life is about to change for each and every person on this planet and with life changing on this planet that means you have to change whatever that has been happening there's a lot of people talking there's people trying to profit from your own thing whatever is this is going to end and then you're going to see you're going to get a message and this message is going to open up a lot of doors and opportunities and good news there's a lot of news that is coming in for a lot of people and um for most of you you're going to realize how wonderful and how positive certain aspects and certain situations are because you will see that certain situation in your life is going to change for the best there's a lot of luck that is coming in there's a lot of luck and success that is coming in for most of you there's a lot a lot of luck and that, uh, that's coming in and a lot of connection with other people a lot of lot a lot of connection with soul family sometimes I'm guided by my angels to use certain cards and um, it's 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 an extreme positive situation that is going on but yet still some of these cards you have to be um, um, in the sense of knowing how to use these energies because um, it's it's a sense of positive situation that are happening in your lives i'm going to use the orbs card because i've have i haven't used them um for a while and somehow my guides and angels show me that i have to use the orbs cards in this week and i always follow them because there's always beautiful messages coming out because you guys are having situation and i've got it um archangel pull kit and mess d Archangel Pulkit and Mercy D. Okay, this is so beautiful because what happened is that these are orbs card. You can um, just focus and concentrate on them, and you will feel uh, your energy vibration really changing. They're powerful, powerful cards. I'm going to look to see what is happening. They're extremely, extremely powerful cards, and I and and that is. Uh, the energy of number 16 which is 7 and you have number 28 again which is 10 and there is somewhere number 28 came up okay this is 10 so another wheel of fortune and with this one um, please come back and read this you have Archangel Shamuel, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Michael, Archangel Uriel, Archangel Metatron, by Bill by Saint Germain um, Elmora Lord Kutumia Lord Maitre Mercedes um, Saint Illyrian Paul the Virgin um, Divi um, Sirasmus Bay Lanto Commander Astra Commander Astra okay so all of these ascendance masters are going to work with you guys because as we look we have something with a 333 that was there this is the sign of the ascendance masters that are going to work with you and if you realize this orb because most of the time um, because we're not aware we see rainbows and that rainbow is telling you something because it's the universe and so and the source of all things is saying that whatever your situation is there is a rainbow at the end of uh, this okay so this is wonderful you, that you guys got these two but um, um Melchior the dish he came out twice in these uh, cards look he's here Pulka is a, is a um is um the uh, angel of uh, um the the forest and you have by wheel and you have Pulka another time and you have also and you have also my to this so this this is a really 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 good okay it's gonna be as a real um, I, I guess as I've always said that the universal beams are coming through and they're coming through very strong because um, they're guiding me the ascendance masters 
And now I understand or guided me to use the Ascension cards. And let's see what we have for you guys in this year. The sun. This is wonderful. This is so wonderful. The sun energy. And the sun energy is in the reading for, for you guys. So the sun energy is going to be... Um, and this is the source of all things. And it says the sun, the navel of the chakra of this universe, it radiates the divine masculine purity. Choosing this card suggests that the universe is calling on you to develop your qualities of this decisiveness action, protecting the volunteered rational thinking, courage and strength. Involve the sun in order to lighten up your aura and fill you with renewal enthusiastic for life. This energy will enable you to um, help everyone feels welcome and empower, which is an important um, ascension quality. Your guidance is to fill your aura with radiant glory, um, golden light, be true to yourself and act decisively today. I radiate golden light and take decisive actions today. I radiate golden light and take cypher's action today. So, what's the effort that is going on for each and every person? Once you were born between the, the ages, the um, dates of 7 August and um, 7 August, 7 August. So 13 August, it's going to be positive, okay? And I want to say to each and every one, have a wonderful week and a wonderful birthday year of 2017. And I'll speak to you next week. Namaste.